Hi everyone, I'm Jake. Welcome to Green World product training video. And the product that we are talking about today is intestine cleansing tea, what we also call as in cleansing tea. As the name suggests, intestine cleansing tea. This tea helps in cleaning our intestine, that is our small intestine, our large intestine, what we also call as our gut. And trust me, everything starts from our gut, whether it's happiness, or it is a disease. It all stems out of our intestines. And for that reason, Green World stepped forward and invented this incredible in cleansing tea. And let me tell you one more thing. It's not just a green tea that you get on the shelf of a supermarket. It is Green World's intestine cleansing tea. And that's what I'm gonna explain to you. So now we are talking about intestine cleansing. So as we all know in our day-to-day -day life, in our food, in our air, in our water, toxins starts entering in our body and that is unavoidable because the kind of lifestyle that we have today. Toxins are a part and parcel of our life but we gotta learn to deal with them. Toxins are those harmful substances which our body does not need but unfortunately it cannot automatically remove them also. Toxins exist in almost all our organs, in our tissues, in our blood and almost every part of our body. I mean, they are those silent invaders which are completely terrorizing our body from inside. Being a part of Green World, I'm sure you all are uh, quite aware about the presence of toxins in our body. Uh, you know, through various trainings, we always talk about toxins. But do you know actual quantity of those toxins in our body? I'll tell you now, I'll reveal some uh, numbers the quantity of toxins in different organs and you will be quite sure so the amount of toxins in our intestinal tract is 1.15 kgs and throughout all the joints in our body almost three kgs of toxins are there liver and gallbladder 500 grams to 5 kgs and various other parts of our body 500 grams up to 2 kgs and depending on our individual lifestyle around 3 to 25 kgs of toxins can be removed from the body. Now let's take a look at the sources of these toxins, how they find their way into our body. So mainly there are two types of sources and number one is exotoxin. Environmental pollution like air pollution, water pollution and uh, so many uh, like uh, different types of industrial pollution, then chemicals, all those things together bring in lots of toxins in our body. Then unhealthy lifestyle, you know, late night uh, parties or <laughs> drinking alcohol, smoking, all these things create stress and that also generate toxins in our body. Then we also have unbalanced food habits. So that includes all our junk food and pizzas and pasta and burgers and muffins and whatnot. Then we have our second source of toxins and that is endotoxin, means the toxins which are uh, generated inside our body. And the reasons for that, number one is of course, uh, the uh, byproducts of metabolism, example, free radicals. And then we also have digestive problem issues like constipation. Constipation generates lots of toxins in our entire intestinal tract. So out of all these toxins present in our body, which we can't see, the most invisible toxins are the free radicals. Free radicals are the most prevalent and tiniest toxins in our body and it exists in all parts of our body. Excess amount of free radical in our skin cells leads to premature aging and wrinkles on our skin and same way it affects various organs and tissues of our body. Even during our breathing process, the inhalation process, 98% of the oxygen is inhaled while 2% of the oxygen get converted into free radicals. And as I told you about our skin, according to modern research also, free radicals are the head culprit of aging. Now let's talk about the most visible toxin, constipation. Constipation is the source of all toxins in our intestinal tract. If the bowel is not relieved for two days continuously, in that case, constipation is going to generate 36 different kind of toxins in the intestinal tract, which may cause at least 179 types of different diseases. Now, there are a couple of reasons for constipation like lack of exercise, lack of uh, sufficient water intake, lack of fiber in the diet. So many people on a regular basis suffer from constipation. All they do is resort to taking some form of laxative to get that instant relief and then they forget about uh, addressing the underlying problem because if you will not cure it, it turns into chronic constipation that could have some long-term 
side effects on your body but don't you worry because i have a good news for you and that good news is intestine cleansing tea initially in the video i told you that this green world intestine cleansing green tea is just not another green tea from the shelf of a supermarket in green world intestine cleansing tea there are effective elements which can stop the stool from sticking to the intestinal wall and promote the passing of the stool that bowel movement and that's how by cleaning the intestinal passage and walls it stops the production of toxins in intestine so let's now understand what are those effective elements and essential ingredients which are present in green world in cleansing tea there are four main active ingredient cassia seeds, hawthorn berry, green tea leaves and mulberry. Cassia seed has the function of heat removal, eyesight improving and bowel relaxing. So by relaxing our bowels, it helps to relieve constipation. Next ingredient, hawthorn can facilitate digestion, improve the well-being of the stomach, promote the circulation of key or you can also say that it helps in better uh, blood flow to the area. It can be used for the relief of deposition of the meat and uh, expansion of gastric cavity, diarrhea, stomach ache, blood stasis and many other conditions as you can see on the slide. Next ingredient is mulberry. Mulberry has the function of nourishing yin and blood, promoting the secretion of saliva. So when we eat food, our saliva in our mouth is secreted, which helps in better digestion of our food once it reaches our stomach. Furthermore, it nourishes our liver, our kidney and body fluid and relieves dizziness as well. Then it can quench our thirst and relieve constipation. Last but not the least, the green tea leaf. The caffeine contained in this green tea leaf can help in the secretion of the stomach, thus helping with the breakdown and digestion of the fat, which is one of the main reasons for getting constipated. Furthermore, it can help our intestine to remove the harmful toxins from our body. So with the combination of all these wonderful ingredients, intestine cleansing tea performs this incredible function of relieving constipation and you can see on the slide how it does that. It basically lubricates our intestinal walls and thereby it softens the hard and dry stool. It promotes the multiplication of beneficial bacteria in our intestine. It also promotes the absorption of water in our intestine. When we start drinking in cleansing tea regularly, it basically cleans our intestine walls completely and it removes the toxins. It helps to replenish nutrients and nourish our body. It also repairs the damage intestinal tract mucosa and thereby restore the normal function of our intestine. In general, I would say that everybody should drink in cleansing tea, but specifically, yes, people who suffer from constipation or people who have uh, any kind of digestive issues and also people with uh, acne, dry skin, color spots, yellow complexion, even loose skin. As far as the usage of in cleansing tea, it's fairly simple. Uh, my personal uh, way of using it is when I get up in the morning, first thing that I do is uh, boil a glass of water and put my sachet of in cleansing tea into it, leave it for 5 to 10 minutes and then drink it. And good part about in cleansing tea or any green world uh, green tea is that one sachet can be used four times means to make four cups of tea so advisable uh, in case of people who have constipation to drink at least uh, twice a day but to maintain general uh, well-being and health uh, one cup in the morning is good enough all right guys so that was all about the green world in cleansing tea i would say please don't wait to get constipated to drink in cleansing tea even to maintain the optimal health of your intestine in cleansing tea is a must for every person bye